Colleagues, today we're speaking about an area, the Caucasus. It's a strategic crossroads, globally speaking. It's a region with incredible potential, a potential which only can be realized if there is proper cooperation between Armenia and Azerbaijan. On the one hand, we are encouraged by the contacts between the parties. And we have uh, the resolution, of course, which, of course, uh, expresses itself quite positively with regard to the reciprocal recognition of uh, territorial integrity of Azerbaijan and Armenia. It's a first step in the resolution of this conflict. Um, and this type of recognition allows for people to live in peace and security within their respective borders. But at this point in time, as was said, we are all very concerned about the situation in the Lachin Corridor. Uh, we followed with great attention and very, very carefully what's going on on the ground there. And of course, the various debates between the committees have expressed this great concern. We have two different narratives here. Uh, now, according to the tripartite agreement of 2020, the corridor ought to be protected by peacekeeping forces of the Russian Federation. And uh, according to this particular agreement, Moscow assumes a geopolitical role of great importance in the region. Uh, but uh, the situation now that exists and the numerous different victims and refugees which have been generated by the situation is of great uh, concern for the international community. This is an obstacle to peace and stability in the region. So uh, the third parties, which have a very specific role to play, but also have their own economic interest there, well, they have to overcome those and look at the situation there to try to protect the Lachin Corridor, to protect the population in the area, which is affected by its blockage. And I think, indeed, between both uh, countries, we see an escalation of tension. Uh, rather than constructive dialogue on this particular issue, we have to respect international law. We have to respect the UN Charter with regard to the sovereignty, sovereignty of nations and absolutely avoid under all costs any type of use of uh, weapons. In Washington, there will, be, uh, there will be discussions on this particular issue, of course, and of within the United Nations as well. The EU as well is on the verge of, or rather has just adopted a resolution with regard to this. And this particular uh, resolution as well is extremely important in a f as a first step to finding some sort of solution to this particular problem and to normalize this situation in the area to achieve stability as well. This assembly, with all of its instruments, with everything at its disposal, uh, will do all and has done all to support peace, stability, uh, so that the people in Azerbaijan...